Hey there, I'm Austin with JUNU210, and welcome to this discussion of journalism ethics in the film State of Play. This film addresses many facets of the Society of Professional Journalists' Code of Ethics, and I'm going to elaborate on and show you examples of a few of them from the film. Now, the film accurately portrays the handling of anonymous sources. The SPJ code says, quote, Identify sources whenever feasible. Always question sources' motives before promising anonymity. Clarify conditions attached to any promise made in exchange for information. Keep promises. Unquote. Well, in the film, it is certainly not always possible to release sources' names, as you will see. You got the names of the victims for me? You gotta be kidding me. You know, I'm gonna find out anyway. Not for me. Okay, you wanna play a little confirm or deny? I'm not playing this game with you, Cal. Look, Don, I got a living to make, right? I got mouths to feed, goldfish. <laughs> no names, no quotes, all right? Okay. You understand my terms? I will not give you my name. I will not give you my rank in the Point Corps military structure or the in and out dates of my service. Understand. Now, the film also shows its journalists encountering or engaging in less than ethical practices, such as paid sources. Rhonda Silver. Nobody's got her yet. She changed her name a couple times in the past year. Don't you get it? I had to agree to go on not one but two dates with a sweaty guy named Vic. Don't even ask me. The SPJ code says, quote, be wary of sources offering information for favors or money, unquote. Good thing for them to remember. Another thing that Cal, the protagonist, should have remembered was the SBJ code on conflicts of interest. They say, quote, avoid conflicts of interest, real or perceived, unquote. Well, that didn't happen. Hey, I got a question for you. Stephen Collins, he's an old friend of yours, is that right? Yeah. What's funny about you? Every time your friend runs for re-election or conducts a hearing, you drop his name to me until we give him some coverage. But he finally does something that actually might sell some newspapers. You're rendered new. You have injected yourself in this story right from the beginning, and we all know why. Despite this lapse of judgment, Cal does embody the SPJ principle, seek truth and report it. PluggedInOnline.com, a family movie review site, says of Cal, quote, He's a professional scribbler with no set agenda except to do his best, help his friend, if possible, and print the whole story, not just the salacious bits, unquote. You know, in the middle of all this gossip and speculation that permeates people's lives, I still think they know the difference between real news and... And they're glad that someone cares enough to get things on the record and print the truth. Well, thanks so much for watching. This has been Austin for Journey 210.